Hi, I'm Dr. James. Have you ever wished you could actually change your genetic blueprint? I know that now in my early 50s, I think about it a lot and I'm really fascinated by this uh, idea in the research that comes out on something called epigenetics. And it has a lot to do with uh, many different things out there, but one of the key pieces is that how your environment really affects how your genes express themselves in a positive environment, uh, natural light, natural food, healthy people, vibrant uh, living, all those things actually have an effect on your blueprint in terms of how your genes actually express themselves, whether it be a healthy direction or an unhealthy direction. And the thing that's really interesting about this is that you really have every moment of your life, you can kind of look around and think to yourself, gosh, you know what, between the television, the people, the media, uh, my food, you name it, all the different things that we surround ourselves with, that plays a big role in how our genes express themselves. That to me is really exciting. I think to myself, my goodness, you know what, I can literally paint a picture of a lot of positivity every single day of my life. And not only does it make me feel wonderful, it actually changes the way that my genes want to express and express more and more health. And that's awesome. And it comes back to a really cool thing. It reminds me, back in my early 20s, I was doing a meditation retreat. And after I was done with the retreat, I got a chance to ask the teacher a certain question around how it is that when you're in a place where you're not really living um, up to your best self, when you're around people who necessarily aren't the most positive people, the environment may not be so positive. He said, you know, what's really amazing is that we have a responsibility to ourselves and to our spirit and to our body that he said this, he said, if you ever find yourself in a dark room, excuse yourself from that room immediately. And I think that metaphor is such a powerful way to lead your life every single day. Think about in your life, do you live yourself and let yourself go into places where they're dark, where you're around people who don't nourish you, don't support you, don't believe in you? Do you allow yourself at night to let yourself be exposed to television and media that stresses you out, that makes you depressed, that makes you defensive? If you do, excuse yourself from that place and give yourself permission to not dim your light anymore to raise the vibration, to brighten the light, and give yourself permission to live the life you came here for. Epigenetics is a fabulous field of study, and it gives us permission now to believe in the science of the environment and its relationship to us and how we can feel great. So take this and run with it. Paint the picture of positivity, give yourself the environment you want, and live the life you've imagined today.